this is the first season now where you're single on the show. I mean, yeah, technically last season I was, but I mean, when you're going through the first initial stage of divorce and breaking up with somebody, you're, you're still attached to that person and that relationship. It was, it wasn't an easy process, even though I was technically single. This is the first season I think I've been fully like embracing that life. And what does that mean for the new season <laughs> coming up? It means you're going to see very different side of me. And, you're, and and I think, well, in general, just aside from the show, but just in the stage of my life, I think I was much more open to dating and really, truly meeting someone and being available to actually like have feelings for someone and really wanting to date someone. I think that first year I was kind of like, I'm down to have fun and put myself out there to like just being with another person, you know, in, in some kind of capacity, but not really, I didn't want anything from anybody. I was like, do not catch feelings from me because I don't have those to give back to you. But this year I was just like, you know what? I think I could, I think I could have feelings for someone. And I, and I caught feelings a few times for sure. Are you on the dating apps? No. Can you be? I could if I wanted. I okay. I it's kind of a lie. <laughs> I did hinge when I went to Europe uh, last like springtime. I was like, you know what? I feel like I, I I'm I'm willing to like put myself out there on this thing because it's like another country. I'm not gonna like find or get matched with anybody I know. And I just thought it'd be like a fun thing to try out. But I don't know. I just any successes. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it was fun. I don't know. Um, but here, I don't know. Yeah. What is dating like in LA now? Ugh. Terrible. Last time I was single, the dating apps didn't exist. It was not a thing. You just met people the old fashioned way, like just out in the, the wild. I prefer, Ugh. like, <laughs> I prefer, I like to meet people, yeah, just in real life or through friends or referrals <laughs> recommendations that kind of thing because I don't know I just feel like the, what I hear from everybody what I've been hearing from my friends throughout the years is just that it's just really daunting on the apps so why put myself through that it's a lot I don't know I, I just think if you meet somebody in real life you're gonna know right away if you have a connection and I think that just kind of like cuts out all that like time spent trying to talk to somebody. Not that that doesn't happen anyway, because I, I, I do meet people through like Instagram, through the DMs. You know? And then what does a date with you look like? Are you going out <laughs> to dinner? Is it drinks? Um, Depends on the person. I mean, I've done, I've got, I mean, I've done all, of, all the dates, you know, I've, I've had dinner, I've had drinks, I've had coffee, I've had, you know, I, like all the standard whatever kind of dates there hasn't been a lot of second dates. i mean that's what my single friends say around mm. here because i never really had a date in la so i feel like at least from a girl's perspective it's so much harder uh, i do you know what the problem is too i keep meeting people that don't live in la oh like they might be here but they they're like la is not their like their home right and i'm fine with that like i don't i don't necessarily need to meet someone that like i, I don't mind doing like a long distance thing but it's getting you know someone that's down to commit to that process of it all what's it like when you tell them that you're on a reality show <laughs> either they they know because the referral the ref yeah a friend kind of like gives them a <laughs> heads up and lets them know or it's like if i meet them through like instagram it's the, the information's kind of there a little bit. Yeah. You and DM people? I have. Whoa. I know. It's fun. <laughs> Why not? I don't yeah. know. What's the worst that's going to happen? They never open it. Or they just don't reply. Or Were there any long shots with anybody? Like Chris Hemsworth. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. Um, no, but there, I. You should reach for the stars. <laughs> Chris Hemsworth. Isn't he married, though? Yeah. I, um, I would never anyone that's married. No. And that's the one thing that you have to do is you really have to kind of sometimes comb through to try to find a sign of like a girlfriend or a wife because I would never want to like 
slide in if there is somebody, you know, that would right. be treacherous. But, um, <laughs> but yeah, I mean, there's definitely been a couple, and I did get replies, but not it didn't really go anywhere. Right. It was just like, hi, how you doing? And then that's it. 